Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to extract web page source and then storing it into a text file. So for that, we are importing Java IO file, Java IO file writer, then Selenium and Selenium Firefox package. Once you have these package added here, get into public static void main method. And here we are going to create instance of Firefox. And then we will navigate to example.com web page. So driver.get http example.com. You can pick any other website, but just make sure that the code that it is going to print on your console as well as on your text file will be a lot bigger. So to avoid that, I'm using this simple website called example.com. Now let's create a string called source and use driver.get page source. So this method will help us to extract HTML code from the web page. And we're going to print that out on our console okay now inside try and catch method we are going to handle our file handling part so first use file new text file equals to new file and here I'm going to give the path for where I'm going to store that file so it's selenium demo.txt right so after that use file writer fw equals to new file file writer and here i'm going to pass our new text file instance after that we will write our string that contains our web page source here so once you have that now we can close once that is copied For catch block, we will use an exception, right? So let's simply print out system out print e. Okay, so our code is ready. Okay, what we did, we imported necessary packages, also created instance of Firefox to navigate to example.com. Then we store web page source into a string called source and then we created a file on D drive and we are now reading that file at the same time we are also copying content of our string into that file after that using catch block to catch any exception if there is any so this is pretty much our code so let's run our code here so this will open instance of Firefox pay attention to the console here you'll find that our console has all the web page source code okay so let's close Firefox right now and then go to my computer then D drive and you'll find selenium demo Okay, so this is the web page source code stored in file selenium demo.txt. So now you know our code works exactly the way we want it. Now you know how to get the page source, store it into the string called source, and then copy it into selenium demo text file, and then close that text file. 
Just pause the video, go through the code and execute.